guys welcome to my channel today we're gonna show you guys what we're selling here this is the shoe rack that we are selling on our website and we're gonna show you how to assemble this shoe rack okay you may begin Okay, it, it comes with uh, 20 poles and five of these uh, racks, yeah, these stands. Side panels. Side panels. It comes with five because the last panel will be dividing it into half. So it will be the top piece. You see these pieces it can separate. You see? It can separate. That's why sometimes when you guys buy the Shurak from us and you say uh, there is uh, why, why is there only five uh, side panels? Then we always have to tell you because the last panel you can separate it in half and then it will stack on top of the the, the shoe rack and then it will become the 30 pair shoe rack okay now now we'll show you <clears throat> you see on the side panels there's these holes these are the holes where you'll be sticking the poles inside so make sure you stick the poles tightly inside you, you can see these different uh, holes and heights which means you can tilt your shoe rack up and down or sideways you see the inner ones you can if you put it in the the inner holes it will basically be for kid shoes the outer layer will be for adult shoes and those top holes will be for like when you want to tilt your shoes but now we are gonna just make it straight for you guys to see Make sure it is tightly inside those holes. You don't need to stick it very hard. But just make sure they're deep inside. We are, ma we are now making the base of the shoe rack. Before we start to uh, stack the shoe rack to make it tall. This is a DIY shoe rack, so I think anyone can make it. But if you have someone at home who can help you with it, you'll be better. But basically, you can do it all by yourself. As you can see the shoe rack is stackable so you can like put the stack uh, at, the, at a small place and all that stuff here yeah. so here's like a small rack already built. You can probably put 12 pairs of shoes on this. Then you continue stacking you'll be 24 pairs and then you add the last piece and then it will be a 30 pair shoe rack. Now we will stack it now now we're gonna show you now you can see this there's, there's these teeth you can see the teeth here it slide through as you can see you just slide it in slide it in and snap it in and then it becomes a side 
as you can see. Okay. You can see the teeth marks here. Once it's snapped, you can see there's like a lock and then it just locks it in. Yes. What are you going to raise it up? Okay. Yeah, I'm going to snap it on here to show them how to snap it on if they want to make their shoe rack bigger. But you, you're also going to make the full rack. Okay. See, this is like a small rack now and fit maybe six pairs of shoes but that is like for the top piece so you stack it on top to make it bigger Just snap. Just squish it in and then just snap it. And then must make sure the poles go back in as you can see here. Poles are coming off but just push push it back into those holes. Yes, now we're just gonna snap the rest of the pieces to show you the full rack. Right now I'm doing a, a tilted one. So it tilts like this. Okay, we're gonna, she's doing a tilted one just to show you guys what it looks like after we snap it onto the Pretty shoe rack. Shoes inner ones because this makes it more narrow you don't always have to do that you can also do it like this if your kitty shoe is a little bit bigger also so i'll do that kitty shoe normal size and then another tilted one on the other side So that 
holes. Okay, she's just snapping it on now. The shoe rack is made of plastic, but it's hard plastic, so it can hold heavy shoes. And these are made of steel. Yeah, it's very, very durable and strong. Tilted. You see, it's tilted. Mm. Kitty shoes, the smaller shoes, the adult shoes, adult shoes. This one's tilted downwards. So, so it's done, huh? Yeah, and say so, you know, you don't just have to put shoes. You can see we, uh, she is standing next to the shoe rack, the shoe racks, oh, and she's like almost one. 1.65 meters so tall so this shoe rack is like 1.65 meters tall once it's fully built as you can see good to place your shoes and it saves a lot of space and you can see i also use one myself i just use a uh, like half a shoe rack plus one more piece and then yeah then i put all my shoes